We have this set in our studio for the next five hours. So what we want to do is live composite from Unreal Engine 5 onto this green screen window. This is how we're going to do it. This is Cesium for Unreal Engine, and this is our API controller flight deck. Josh, Austin, and myself are going to come up with three different scripts, decide on one, and then shoot on it on that green screen window using Cesium and flight deck. To make this live composite happen, we have two steps. One is using a Moses Star Tracker to get our tracking data so we can track it onto the green screen. And the second part is this Ultimat 4K from Blackmagic Design, which is gonna make our live composite possible. We're then gonna send that to the HyperDeck so that we can see the live composite when it's recorded. And now, on to the scripting. Okay, so we're all getting 10 minutes to script out our idea. Okay, my 10 minute timer starts now. Okay, here's what I'm thinking. I literally have no idea where I'm starting, where I'm going, what I'm even gonna do. One character, he's incarcerated, so the set is like a prison cell. First variation of the script was not amazing. I randomly have been thinking about Mount Rushmore lately, so maybe that'll be in there. He's looking at the earth, he's looking at the ocean, and the Alcatraz kind of thing. Something about dreaming big. It's a motivational, positive thing. Futuristic infomercial. I think it has to be so dumb that they just look at it and they're like, well, we have to do that one. So that's probably what I'm gonna do. Put a pen to paper and see where we can get. Awesome, could I just get you to leave the room for Okay. Okay, so just because we only had 10 minutes each to shoot this, I feel like whoever's gonna have the most, the best presentation is gonna win this because all of our scripts are bad. So, what I'm gonna do is just come out the gates, full entrepreneurial mindset, shark tank mode, and hopefully these guys will pick my pitch to be the winner because my script is brutal. Oh, you guys, what's up? Come on, come on in. Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Picture this, all right? A real estate agent shows a guy a new room in a flat. A view of the Eiffel Tower through the window. Yeah, so this is the place. Uh, it's so and so amount. And of course, you've got the beautiful view. Oh, yeah, Big Ben in the background. I love that. And then they, uh, they, they fight back and forth. They huh? fight? They fight like. They argue over what's Big Ben and what's the Eiffel Tower? Yeah. <laughs> or they fist fight. They just have an awkward argument about. Big Ben versus Eiffel Tower. I love it. We should do that. <laughs> he does the same thing he did. He goes like, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, have you sold? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> and then yeah. he's like, yeah, I'll take it. He's like, perfect. And then just like, <laughs> hey, I love that pitch. You're gonna, that's such a good idea. He took over the pitch for you. It's a great idea. Who's next? Interior. Prisoner. In a cell. <laughs> Guy in there, he's sitting, he's journaling. Right, he's writing about his time. He hears a buzz in the corner, and the blinds start to go like they're moving up on their own. He doesn't do it, the blinds move up, and then he turns and looks out the window, and he's staring back at Earth. Damn. Prisoner in outer space, Damn. banished from civilization. But what'd he do? Okay. Yeah, we don't know. We don't know. Um, okay, thoughts. There you go. Okay. That's the pitch. Thank you. I like that. Okay. 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 So here's my idea. Say goodbye to your boring, old, expensive windows and say hello to the new window. Whenever you're feeling gloomy, say, hey new window, make me feel melancholy. When you're looking to brighten your day, say, hey new window, brighten my day. For all your regular window needs, use new window. A window into your world. And that's my bit. It's an infomercial for a window. That does anything that a normal window would do. Is it actually a window? It's more like a TV screen window. Okay, okay. Third so we're gonna rank them from one to three on each other's idea. You can use your own idea. Well, you have to. And then we're three going three. to basically, in private, each person give them the three, uh, the, rank the three ideas. Yeah, yeah, the best. I think I'm gonna give three points to my idea. I thought it was funny. Two points, I'm gonna give it to Josh G. I think there's a really funny scene that can take place, but it's a lot of work to do in the time frame we have. 
And one point I'm gonna give to Josh K because it's probably the most difficult idea. I'm out. Real clear for me, real clear. Everyone, Fred Chilbilly, three points. Great script, really tight, it's a whole story. Second, Space Prisoner, because I wrote it. Uh, third, uh, Austin's infomercial, because, uh, I don't know. Oh, I think that went great. Comparatively, three points, me. Two points, Prisoners. One point, Austin's infomercial. More? Do you mind to bring it up a little bit? What we have here is the live composite of our final output frame. We're not gonna be doing any post work other than like color. Other than that, all we're gonna do is just film the scene the way that we want and it'll be ready to show people. It looks great, Josh. It's like a 45, more like 30 degrees. Like you want to get the reflections at this corner of the room. Yeah, we can shoot this corner. You were right. Man, this place is beautiful. Ah. What? That we made. I hope you. I hope you enjoy. Damn, Francis. <laughs> Francois. Yeah, whatever. I'll take the place. It's beautiful. That's beautiful, Paris. I agree. I just love Big Ben. Big who? Me, Big Ben couple baguettes, some mademoiselle. <laughs> Can't you picture it? It was like I could understand French. <laughs> For the amount of time and money we put into it, I'd expect nothing less. I still think I liked my idea better. Um, and it looks great, truly, looks awesome. <laughs>